Ever pondered why you have your mother's eyes or your father's hair? It's all in your genes. Delving into the world of genetics, it's like opening up an intricate blueprint of life. Each gene, a unique set of instructions, nestled within our DNA, lays out the plan for everything from our height and hair color to the shape of our nose. It's a fascinating world of microscopic complexity where the tiniest of details can dictate the grandest of designs. But these genes are more than just this, uh, the architects of our physical traits. They are also the gatekeepers of our health. You see, buried within these genetic codes are markers that can indicate our susceptibility to various health conditions, from heart disease to diabetes. Sometimes, these genes can go awry, leading to what we call genetic diseases. These are conditions that are directly caused by changes in our genes. They could be as simple as a single misplaced molecule or a missing piece of genetic material. From cystic fibrosis to sickle cell anemia, genetic diseases are as diverse as they are numerous. And it's not just about us. These faulty genes can be passed down from generation to generation like an unwanted inheritance. This means that genetic diseases are not just a personal battle, but a family one. But what if we could rewrite this blueprint to eliminate these diseases? What if we could correct those genetic typos and break the chain of inheritance? That's where a revolutionary tool comes into play, a tool that's not only changing the course of science, but is also reshaping our understanding of life itself. This tool, my friends, is CRISPR, a game changer, a hope bringer, a potential lifesaver. But what is CRISPR? How does it work? And more importantly, what does it mean for us, for our health and for future generations? We'll be diving into all of that and more. So stay tuned as we explore the incredible world of CRISPR. But what if we could rewrite this blueprint to eliminate these diseases? Enter CRISPR, nature's own genetic scissors first discovered in bacteria. These molecular cutters, which stand for clustered regularly interspaced short palindromic repeats, were initially recognized as a part of a primitive immune system in bacteria. They serve as a memory bank, allowing bacteria to remember and destroy viruses they've encountered before. The true potential of CRISPR was realized when scientists discovered that it could be repurposed as a tool to edit genes in any organism, not just bacteria. This was a game changer. Imagine being able to cut and paste genes like text in a document, giving us the power to rewrite the very code of life itself. CRISPR works in a fascinating way. The system uses two key molecules. One is an enzyme called Cas9, which acts as the scissors, cutting the DNA at a specific location. The other is a piece of RNA known as guide RNA, which directs the Cas9 to the right part of the genome. The beauty of this system is its precision. Like a tailor making a bespoke suit, CRISPR can make alterations to our genetic fabric with an astounding level of detail. It's like finding a single misspelled word in an entire library and correcting it without changing the meaning of any other sentence. So we've got our scissors, but how exactly does this gene editing work? Imagine editing a movie scene. You locate the scene, cut the unwanted part, and replace it with the desired footage. CRISPR does something similar but with genes. It's a revolutionary tool that's changing the game in genetic engineering. So, how does CRISPR work? Well, let's break it down. CRISPR stands for Clustered Regularly Interspaced Short Palindromic Repeats. Quite a mouthful, right? But don't worry, we don't need to remember that. What we do need to understand is the role of two key players in the CRISPR system, the Cas9 protein and guide RNA. Cas9, often referred to as molecular scissors, is an enzyme that can cut DNA. It's like the director of our movie making the cuts where necessary. But how does Cas9 know where to cut? That's where guide RNA comes into play. Guide RNA is a small piece of pre-designed RNA sequence that matches the DNA sequence of the gene we want to edit. It's like the script that guides the director to the right scene. When the guide RNA finds its matching DNA sequence, it binds to it, and Cas9 makes the cut. This cut then triggers the cell's natural repair mechanism, which can be tricked into introducing the desired genetic material into the DNA sequence. And just like that, we've successfully edited a gene. Sounds like a game changer, right? Let's explore the potential of CRISPR. Imagine a world where genetic diseases are a thing of the past. CRISPR could make this a reality. The potential of CRISPR stretches beyond our wildest dreams, promising a future where we might just be able to rewrite the genetic code of life itself. 
In the realm of medicine, the possibilities are particularly exciting. Cutting-edge research is already underway, employing CRISPR to tackle genetic disorders head-on. Take cystic fibrosis, for instance, a life-shortening disease that affects tens of thousands worldwide. The culprit? A single gene mutation. But imagine if we could simply edit that faulty gene, replacing it with a healthy one. Or consider sickle cell anemia, a condition that transforms round, flexible red blood cells into rigid, sickle-shaped ones. With CRISPR, we might be able to correct the gene responsible, offering a potential cure for a disease that currently has none. But the promise of CRISPR extends beyond the treatment of existing conditions. Imagine the ability to prevent the transmission of specific genetic diseases to future generations. We could potentially eliminate hereditary conditions from family lines, reshaping the genetic landscape of humanity, and it's not just human health that stands to benefit. Think about agriculture. CRISPR could help us create crops resistant to disease, reducing our reliance on harmful pesticides, or we could engineer plants with improved nutritional value, combating malnutrition in regions where food options are limited. But with this new frontier of genetic editing, we must tread carefully. The power to alter the very building blocks of life is immense, and with great power comes great responsibility. We need to ask ourselves, are we ready to wield this tool? How do we ensure that it's used ethically and wisely? But with great power comes great responsibility. What about the ethical considerations? Designer babies, unintended mutations. These are some of the ethical dilemmas that CRISPR presents. Imagine the ability to select desirable traits for your offspring, height, intelligence, eye color. It sounds like a sci-fi movie, but with CRISPR, it's now within the realm of possibility. However, the prospect of such designer babies raises a host of social and ethical questions. Furthermore, the risks of off-target edits are real. Unforeseen mutations could occur with potential impacts that we might not fully understand until it's too late. Hence, the need for caution and stringent oversight cannot be overstated. Currently, regulations vary globally, and discussions about the ethical use of CRISPR in humans are ongoing. These conversations are crucial to ensure that we strike a balance between leveraging the immense potential of CRISPR and mitigating its risks. As we navigate this ethical maze, the future of CRISPR remains full of potential. So what does the future hold for CRISPR and us? As we venture further into the 21st century, the potential of CRISPR technology unfolds like a science fiction novel. It's a tool that could redefine medicine, healing genetic disorders, and wiping out hereditary conditions that have plagued humanity for generations. Beyond health, this technology could revolutionize agriculture, creating crops resilient to disease and enriched with nutritional value. Yet this brave new world is not without its challenges. The concept of designer babies, the potential for unintended consequences, and the specter of eugenics all loom large. These are complex ethical questions that we must grapple with as we shape the future of this powerful tool. Current regulations and ongoing discussions are vital to ensure the responsible use of CRISPR in humans. The journey is not a simple one, but it's surely an exciting adventure. The future of CRISPR is as exciting as it is challenging. Stay tuned as we continue to explore this fascinating frontier.